If you live in a large city, then chances are you have to regularly deal with poor air quality. My son actually deals with asthma and allergies, so we're definitely affected by the air quality outdoors. Sometimes it feels like going indoors could be a great escape from those outdoor air pollutants. Indoor air is five times more polluted than outdoor air. We each take about 20,000 breaths per day and 90% of those are indoors where the air is much more polluted. In this video, I'll be partnering with Neoplants to take a look at the Neopx, a nature-based solution that uses symbiosis to purify the air around it. Let's go ahead and get started. Setting up the Neopx was super simple. All I had to do was take this out of the box and remove the craft paper. I then picked up and set the plant over to the side, cleaned out the shell and water tank of all the dirt and debris that was left there. From there, I put the plant basket back into the shell, making sure that the basket and the shell were perfectly aligned. After that, it was time to water the plant. This is actually my favorite part of the whole setup is the self-indicating water system. So you just pour the water right there in the front of the shell, and as you fill up the water tank, the little green indicator rises. You just fill this up until it reaches the top. The most important part of this entire setup is definitely the power drops. This is what powers the air purification capabilities in the Neo-PX. All you have to do is take one of the power drop pouches that came with the Neo-PX, empty it into the beaker that also came with the Neo-PX, fill the water all the way up to the water line there and then mix it with the stirrer. Once the mixture is fully dissolved, you can just simply pour this into the plant. You can use the stir stick to kind of direct this to the plant itself and give this time to soak into the soil. It may take several minutes. Uh, you don't wanna pour it all at once because you want to avoid getting the mixture into the water tank. Uh, but after a few minutes, you should be able to pour out all the solution into the soil. And then the final thing was just finding the perfect place for my plant. So like I mentioned earlier, my son deals with asthma and especially allergens like dust and pollen. So we have lots of different mechanical air filters throughout the house to help us tackle those issues. Mechanical air purifiers actually do a great job at collecting particulate matter but don't touch VOCs. Volatile organic compounds found in cleaning supplies, varnish on wood furniture, makeup, or fumes from cooking are untouched by mechanical air purifiers and constantly pollute your indoor air. The mechanical air filters just aren't enough to fully purify the air in my home. This is where Neoplants comes in. The Neopx is a bioengineered air purifier and it looks amazing pretty much anywhere that we put it. This features a Marble Queen Pothos which is definitely a beautiful plant. Marble Queen Pothos are known for their natural air purifying abilities. The shell of the Neo-PX is designed to increase airflow, boosting its performance. And my favorite part is probably the built-in water tank and water level indicator, which makes maintaining this whole system super easy. The plant inside the Neo-PX only needs your attention about once a month just to add water and to add the power drops. The Neo-PX is powered by nature, so it doesn't need to be plugged into electricity, and the entire setup is made from biodegradable materials, which is healthier for the environment. The Neo-PX gets its groundbreaking capabilities to purify the VOCs from your air through symbiosis. Now, there are tons of different examples of symbiosis in nature. One example that comes to mind is clownfish who live among sea anemones. The sea anemones provide protection for the clownfish while the clownfish provide nutrients to the sea anemone through their waste. Both the clownfish and sea anemone are benefited through this relationship. Certain bacteria had the same type of symbiotic relationship with plants. In 1989, NASA discovered that some plants and their microorganisms have the ability to remove VOCs from the air. Bacteria like Pseudomonas patuta have evolved through nature to use harmful pollutants as energy sources. Neoplants has used years of research and development plus lab assisted evolution to supercharge these kinds of bacteria. And this is where Power Drops comes in. Simply mix the Power Drops formula with water and add this to your Neo-PX about once a month to activate the air purifying properties. The bacteria from the power drops then colonizes the soil, the root system, and even the plant itself, 
and immediately begin to feed off the VOCs in the air around it. The plant and bacteria from the power drops are then able to provide nutrients to one another and thrive from this relationship. The Neoplants team recently took me on a virtual tour of their labs and it was very impressive. Neoplants uses best in class experiment setups for air quality testing Tests are done by a team of indoor air quality experts in collaboration with a third party university leading lab in in air quality. By placing the plant in chambers with VOC emitting materials, they found the NeoPX is effective in removing the three most dangerous VOCs, benzene, toluene, and xylene from indoor air and is up to 30 times more effective in removing these VOCs than ordinary house plants. They've also found that the NeoPX is effective in cleaning air in spaces of up to 160 square feet. The benefit here is that you get an improvement in your indoor air quality in as little as a week. I've been using the NeoPX for about a week in my living room and I can definitely tell the difference in the air quality inside of my home. If you wanna try the NeoPX in your home, be sure to head to the link in the description where you can find out more information about NeoPlants, the NeoPX, and where you can purchase one for yourself. That about wraps it up for this video. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.